I am Abdullah. My question is, if we do any major sin and do tawbah, will Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us? But if we do it again and again and do tawbah to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, does he forgive us? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran, in Surah Furqan, chapter number 25, verse number 70, repents, believes, and does righteous deeds. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will convert his bad deeds into good deeds. So, we need to ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If we ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he will inshallah forgive our sins. And even if you commit the sin again, you should ask repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala again. You may fall into the sin again. You should ask repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala again. But you should not plan that you will commit the sin again. And there are four criteria for repentance. The first is that you should ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The second is that you should stop the act immediately. The third is that if you can undo it, you should undo it. And the fourth is that you should make a strong resolution that you will not do it again. So these are minimum four criteria for repentance. Whenever you commit any sin, you should ask for sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentions in the glorious Quran in several places that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he is of forgiving, he is most merciful. But we need to ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we should make a strong resolution that we will not do the sin again. And especially when it comes to the major sins, we should ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because the criteria for the major sins is that you need to ask repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for that particular sin. The minor sins, they can be washed away. For example, if when you do wudu, if you fast on the day of Arafah, if you fast on the day of Ashura, between Juma and Juma, in these ways, the minor sins, they can be forgiven. But the major sins, they require sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So we should ask sincere repentance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When we are at home, when we are walking, we should do the istighfar continuously. And the more istighfar we do, the more we will get reward for the istighfar that we do. We should keep our tongue moist with the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, with the istighfar. So whatever sins we have committed, we should not despair of the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, La taqnatu min rahmatillah. Do not despair of the mercy of Allah. Inna Allah yaghfiru dhunuba jami'ah. For Allah forgives all sins. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He is the most gracious, He is the most merciful. Inshallah, we will end this session and the remaining part of the session will be continued by my father. I would like to end the session. Wa akhiru da'wana and alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen.